Let's be honest, carving a turkey can be a little intimidating. I'm here to tell you how to do it and how to bring something beautiful to the table. First things first, carve your turkey in the kitchen. Before you start, let the turkey rest for 30 minutes to an hour. You're gonna be tempted to cut into it right away, but resting keeps the meat juicy, and I promise it'll still be hot. Now for the tools. All you really need is a good, sharp chef's knife, a towel, and a cutting board. I'm gonna start by slicing through the skin and following the rib cage down at an angle until I can see the thigh bone. I'll make the first slice through the thigh and then bend the leg and thigh away from the body until the thigh bone pops out. Then I'll remove the thigh along with the leg. Then I'll do the exact same thing on the other side. The wings are really simple. Just turn the turkey on its side and then pull the wing away from the body. Then just slice through right at the joint. To remove the breast meat, you wanna find the keel bone or the breast bone, which is right down the center. You'll make a slice on either side of that. Slice down until you feel the bone and then slice at a bit of an angle following the wishbone and the rib cage. You don't wanna force the knife, just make nice slicing motions through the breast meat. Let the knife do the work. Now I'm gonna get ready to serve. First I'll slice the breast against the grain. This is really nice because each piece gets a little bit of that delicious crispy skin. To prep the wings, I'm just gonna slice right down the center along the joint and then pop the drumstick out. This wing tip you can just remove. Stand the drumstick and the thigh up and pull the drumstick away. Then just slice following the bone. Cut out the thigh bone, just slice on either side and place the knife under the bone to remove it. Once you get that bone out, you can use it for stock. You can garnish it with a little rosemary or whatever herbs you have left over for making dinner. Now you're ready to bring it to the table. So, the next time you're dusting off your electric carving knife and getting ready to carve into a turkey in front of your whole family, think about how easy it is to carve behind the scenes with the right tools. You'll have a really beautiful way to present your turkey without all the stress.